James Holmes will be shackled to the floor during his trial. Alec Baldwin goes on another Twitter rant. Fifty Shades of Grey, the movie, but who will be cast? And the NBA selects its newest players. I'm Hadley Malcolm with What's Trending This Morning. The James Holmes trial is set to start in February, and when it does, the suspect will be anchored to the floor by a harness he'll wear under his clothes. He's worn shackles in pretrial hearings, but his lawyers say that will make him look guilty during the trial. The judge said that the anchoring cable will blend in with computer cables at the defense desk. Holmes is accused of killing 12 people and injuring 70 others in the Aurora, Colorado theater shooting last summer. Alec Baldwin has had yet another meltdown, but in the scheme of his prior transgressions, this one is minor. A Daily Mail reporter alleged Baldwin's wife Hilaria was tweeting lighthearted messages while attending James Gandolfini's funeral. So the actor took to Twitter himself to defend her yesterday in a series of pretty nasty tweets. His account has since been deactivated, and new reports say the reporter may have gotten his time zones wrong, and Hilaria's tweets were hours after the funeral. Let the countdown begin. The film version of Fifty Shades of Grey has a release date. It's set to come to theaters next August. Rumors are rampant about who may be cast in the movie. So who do you think it should be? Weigh in on Twitter by tweeting at USA Today. And the NBA picked its freshman class last night. The Cleveland Cavaliers kicked off the draft by picking Anthony Bennett from the University of Nevada, Las Vegas. Other players who were top picks found themselves almost immediately traded. That includes Nerlens Knoll, who went from the New Orleans Pelicans to the Philadelphia 76ers within half an hour. Look for our analysis on each pick and more coverage at usatoday.com sports. And keep following all these stories and other trending news at usatoday.com.